welcome to another video where today this is going to be a room tour of the new house that I'm just moved into. If you guys haven't watched my Cowboys 2022 diecast review, I was in the middle of moving at the time. But now, almost everything is complete, so I'm going to show my room with all my stuff in it. First, I'll start with my favorite section is the Kyle Bush section. As you can see, you got the different package, uh, Kyle Busch Authentic Snipecast and stuff. You got the Rowdy Energies there. We got the autograph Kyle Busch version. My friend gave it to me at Sonoma, so shout out to Jordan. You got more Rowdy Energies here, and these are just the solo cars. You got the COT Rush here. You got the Gen 6. Let's see, uh, I want to get a Gen 7 or Next Gen uh, 124. There's the Xfinity, the 2021 Cup version, and the 2022 Xfinity. Oh god, I'm sorry. The 2022 uh, Next Gen Diecast. Uh, I will send the video in the link in the description below. I can't talk, I can't talk today. And there, and there's the two cars from the Kyle Busch 5 pack, as you can see. I reviewed it like a month and a half ago, maybe two months ago, I don't remember. And then at just the bottom, you got more Cowboy Stack Cats. You got the Hollers right there. You got the Rowdy Energy. That's the Rowdy Energy Calorie Burns or something like that. You got the Gold Series boxes. You got a uh, Bubba Wallace Holler. You got more cards and stuff. There's the box. But yeah, this is my favorite part out of the whole uh, room because it's such so much items and together it makes it variety of colors and it's just cool in my opinion so anyways uh let's go to this section right here these are just all my authentics right here it's good see you get the next gen cars we can i got the kevin harvick one and these are just test cars that's the suarez uh test car for some reason i don't know why they didn't make the number chrome Maybe it's because the authentics and it's just a little upgrade from the gold series, but I would still like chrome numbers in my opinion. But yeah, here's more. We got another section right here. This is new. That's that's the Larson New Vegas race version. I got a Keselowski next gen. Not the Dale Jr. Infinity. And this is just test cars, as you can see. Very, very cool. Now you got this. Over here, you got the uh, Will and Byron section. I'm, I do not have a whole lot of Will and Byron section, so. I don't have a lot of Will and Byron stuff, sorry. Over here, you just got 124s up here. It's just a little bit. I'm hoping that I could get, I could buy more so I can fill the shelf. This, that doesn't look complete, but it will be complete in the future. I promise. Let's go to here. This is just like a bunch of st a random stuff here. It's just individuals so and individual 164s that gets right here. You got uh, you got training cards behind it. You get these are my autograph cards. These are just custom cars and stuff. These are just a bunch of like cars that um, that I like and stuff. Some trading cards right here. These are just like special trading cards. I got this from the NASCAR uh, Panini Prism on Amazon in 2020. I got it for 125, I believe. There's the hoods that you could get for the Authentics. Another Authentic section, as you can see. beautiful the variety the variety of colors and the authentic packages makes it even more better in my opinion we got more right here beautiful we got the one we got two 124s up there and a 118 scale the tony stewart 1999 or 2000 
You got the Mark Martin uh, license plate. And you got some more 124s right there. So, Anyways, this is the whole uh, front section. We still got more, so I'll be back. All right, these are just the more final sections right here. So this is a day 100 section. Uh, this is his uh, custom Monte Carlo that they made for him. Oh, these are just my shoe shelves. These are like, that's like a custom Monte Carlo they made for him like in 2000, 1999, I don't remember. Uh, you got this uh, scheme, I forgot what the scheme called is, but it was made from an artist and people did not like it. You just got a couple more. You got the regular good wrench cars and you got the Wrangler car. Yeah, these are just no pads, but I will not use them because collectible. This is Jeff Gordon section. I don't have a lot of Jeff Gordon stuff, so this is his 1997? 1997, I believe. You got his COT and his like 2005, I believe. 19 1995. You got his his Daytona 500 win, and I think this is All Star. I don't remember. And over here you got his uh, i racing car that he ran at North Wilkesboro, and they will be officially running the All Star race on North Wilkesboro, so I'm excited. Over here it's just uh, you got a uh, Fungo Pops, got an Earnhardt, a a, Wall, a Bubba a Junior, and a Gordon. Over here you just got a. Uh, Ben McQueen and Kurt Busch and stuff. And all over here is just a bunch of 164s right here. Which is pretty exciting. And then over here uh, you got more uh, old school packaging right here. As you can see. Very cool. And we're not done yet. So this is the whole. This, that's all the shelves that I have. As you can see. And I got a good year tire right there. That's done. That's I have another one, but I'll show you that later. Anyways, and let's get to my review station where we'll be doing all my diecast reviews and stuff. So this will be my review station, as you can see. Uh this is a desk. It's dirty though, but I will get it clean, don't worry. Um uh, that's my Sonoma Raceway glasses that I went to Sonoma. I got my calendar. Today is the twelfth of September. It's the day that I will be posting this video. And you got a Kevin Harvick poster, The Taste of Victory. It's associated with all the 2022 schedule. Next race is the Bris, uh, Bass Pro Shops NRA Night Race. So. You got Bill Elliott. You got more Roddy Energies. You got Sonoma Raceway Balls. You got an O'Reilly Auto Parts Ball. This, I got this at Sonoma. As you can see. You got a Coca-Cola poster. Coke Zero. Then more bow wall, so these are just my deodorants and stuff. Tape, uh, pencils, so just in case I have to do homework and stuff. This is from the five pack thing. I have to put it like that because the, uh, the background looks very, very cool. You got my checker flag right here next to my bed. Oh, well, on my bed. And then over here, you got my other Goodyear tire. As you can see, there's my bed. I'm sorry if it's messy. You got my other Goodyear bed, as you can see. Very, very cool. And yeah, guys, and that is all my room tour. It's been a pleasure. Uh, hopefully, I'll do more uh, diecast reviews and stuff, because I really want to do more diecast reviews and stuff. But I'll order more next in diecast. And yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like, subscribe, and comment down below what other re uh, reviews should I do. Uh, hopefully I'll get to do more, uh, next-gen reviews. I only have one so far. No, actually I have 12, so, 12 next-gen so far, so. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in the next live streamer video. Goodbye.